everyone and welcome back to my channel today we are doing a like whole get my life together day i really wanted to call the video that but then i thought that might be confusing so i'm just gonna call it clean with me but it's a get my life together video <laughs> so this morning i did all of my christmas clean up everything is up except the tree because i need help um for my husband to get that down because it's just a little bit too big and bulky and heavy and i don't want to attempt that alone um but everything else is put away put up all the ornaments are off and all that kind of stuff and i actually should have already posted that video so you can go check that out first so now what we're doing is cleaning up the rest of my house so the kitchen and cleaning up my office because it was a hot mess actually i already did that so that i could sit here and show you all of this um and cleaning my makeup brushes cleaning up my purse redoing the calendar like all the random things that really need to be done because it's just like a hot mess up in here and all the laundry would you please move Well, I guess it works if you lay down too. Um, so if you are interested in seeing just all of that, seeing me clean everything up and get it back to a nice neutral state, then keep on watching. All right, so as far as cleaning, I started in the kitchen and just got everything there. I find the kitchen the easiest place to start because it's usually, you know, just dishes and wiping down the counters. Um, and then I went into my office and cleaned that up. As you can see, it was a disaster. I got a lot of things from my office over Christmas. I finally replaced my um, Christmas board. I guess this was actually right after Christmas, so it wasn't that big of a deal. My new quote says, life is a lot like jazz. It's best when you improvise, and it's by Gershwin. So here's a little shot of my nice and clean office. Your video now really I got these new pillows yesterday so I've like got my color scheme going and this was a Christmas present it doesn't quite match but I really like it so we're gonna leave it there anyway um this was also a Christmas present it is my uh, logo it's going to go on the wall up there but I haven't gotten quite that far yet right now what we're gonna do is clean out my <laughs> purse so you're probably like that's a really random video I have been meaning to clean out my purse for a long time and it hasn't happened because if you saw any of my vlogs in December, you know I was a little bit busy. Um, and so I'm gonna do it today. And as I was looking through it, I was like, man, there is some weird stuff in here. So I thought it might be entertaining to bring you along for that. So we're just gonna go through it and I'm gonna try to do this as quick as possible. Some things like wallet, that'll stay in there because that's normal. Every lipstick I own, I'll probably take out Let's do that. I'll take out like my summery colors. Sunglasses that are not in here. Pencil. Probably doesn't need to stay. Um, ibuprofen, because headaches, no. Um, drama meme, probably don't need in here. I'm kind of making pile of like, stays in my purse, goes somewhere else. Let's see. Carabas coupons that expired two months ago oh i need that dollar tree receipt that one's important but it doesn't go in my purse so it needs to come over here i'll gotcha tickets <laughs> this bell necklace this kid gave it to me and she was like miss davis i made this for you and then i walked i put it on and i wore it and i walked into her class later on that same day and she goes miss davis why do you have my necklace and i was like I don't really know what to do with that because I feel like I can't throw it away, but like, what else do I do? Contact solution should be in my makeup pouch. Zaxby's receipt. Information about our field trip. Oh, someone's permission slip. I should probably go back to school. <laughs> I'm not even gonna look. I probably don't need you. Walmart. A Halloween necklace, so two months old. Um, this one was given to me by a child 
at the beginning of class and at the end of class he said that I was stupid and ugly and nobody liked me and I was like you're kind of giving me mixed signals bud um oh these cute little Christmassy like eraser tops those are going to school to put in my um what you call it prize box random bracelet I don't know who that belongs to spoon I thought I was out of plastic spoons and then I wasn't so that should probably go back in my kitchen sticky notes I don't need that sticky note though. Fall home tour. Don't forget to do that. Um, things I needed to print at home. At, so we're at two things of sticky notes. Sticky notes. I like write notes to myself and stick them in my purse and then I just take the whole thing home. Expo marker that probably needs to go back to school. Um, that's expired. More little erasers. In, oh, two mints. Okay. Um, one peppermint bark square. Lots more of these. So this is fun. This is a pen I got at my church's back to school event. They gave it to all the teachers. And clearly, I have never used it because it's still in the package. Little jewelry pouch. I like that in case i need to take my jewelry off or i need to like stick something in there oh look at that a whole bunch of candy from my husband's grandparents 50th wedding anniversary party august september little mini um What's that called? Tape measure. These are really helpful, actually. Especially if you're like at a store and you need to buy something. Um, headphones. Helpful, however, should not be just loose in the bottom. Um, car charger. Helpful. Also should not be loose in the bottom. And also, sewing pins. Also don't know why. An envelope that says Disney 2019. March 2019, $200. There's no money in it though. Wow, that was a lot of stuff. Um, so I hope from watching that, you at least got a laugh and maybe you feel a little bit less ridiculous about all the stuff in your purse. And this would also explain why my back or my shoulder hurts so badly because I have all this random crap in here. Let's get back to cleaning. All right, so we, not we, you're not doing anything. I'm about to clean all of my makeup brushes. They are like long, long overdue for a cleaning. Do you see how gross that is? I'm telling you. December, I had so much fun in December. I actually really enjoyed it, but it was stressful. Um, and then, um, so I just use this Essential Tools. This is literally like Walmart brand, but it works great. I've had it for a long time. It's a nice big bottle. Whoop, let's just drop everything over. And then I just got this. I don't remember where it's from, but my husband got it for me for Christmas as like a little stocking stuffer. And it just has all these things so that when you have the soap on the thing, on the things on the makeup brushes you can just rub it in there and it has like a suction so I think it's gonna suction to the sink so we shall see getting all those makeup brushes clean which took a while I put away all the laundry I had been doing laundry all day long and since I had done laundry I then replaced the sheets there is nothing better than clean sheets and Athena apparently thinks so too because she hopped up there as soon as I finished putting the bed together thanks pup 
then did lots of vacuuming and dusting, which is always necessary because I have two dogs and they shed a lot. And here you can see I pulled up my full focus planner and checked off all the things that I had done and it was almost everything. I just have one thing left on there. I can't even read what that says from here. It's probably clean upstairs because that's what I went and did next. So this is a shot of my, I'm calling it my Etsy studio. It's just kind of like where I have all my messy stuff, like sewing and painting and stuff, um, which are all things that are in my Etsy shop. So here's a couple of paintings I've been working on, which explains why my desk is such a hot mess. And now I'm going to clean that up. So mostly I need to put the just kind of organize all of my like markers and pens and stuff that I used to do all of this. I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it's a little bit weird for my channel, but it was very necessary for me to spend this entire stinking day cleaning. Like it was crazy hot mess. Seriously, just needed to get my life together and I felt so much better afterwards. If you found any of this helpful or entertaining, please hit that like button down below. You can also subscribe to my channel for more videos and you can leave a comment and let me know what you think is the best part of your house to clean. Like I said, clean sheets are the best. What do you think is the best to have it nice? stuff. Let me know down in the comments. Thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful, wonderful week.